Maayong gabi sa inyong tanan. We are going to report about the Davao region, which is located on Region 11. I am Ella Panganiban. And I am Mary Angelina Ipoazo. Uh, first, the regional capital of Davao is Davao City. Languages and dialects. Davaoeno, Cebuano, Mandayan, diba? Bawon, Filipino, English, and others. Uh, geographic location. Davao region is designated as Region 11. Is use of the regions in the Philippines, located on the southeastern portion of Mindanao. It is, it is bounded on the North Caraga region, on the uh, coast and south by the Philippine Sea, on the west by Okidnon and Sargent region, composed of four provinces, Compostela, Davao del Norte, Davao del Sur, and Davao Oriental. Uh, uh, first is I'm going to report about the Compostela Valley. Compostela capital, Nabunturan. Languages and dialects, Cebuano, Visayan, Dabuenyo, and English. Its geographic location. Compostela Valley is a province of the Philippines located in the Davao region in Mindanao. The province called Combal for short, used to be part of the Bau del Norte until it was made independent. In 1980, 1998, the province borders the Bau del Norte to the west, Agusan del Sur to the north, and the Bau Oriental to the east. To the southwest lies the Bau Gulf. Cities and municipalities. They have 11 municipalities. Compostela, Laak, Mabini, Mako, Maragusan, Mawab, Moncayo, Montivista, Nabunturan, New Bataan, and Pantupan. Compostela History The province called Combal for short used to be part of the Bau del Norte until it was made independent in 1998. The approval of Republic Act No. 8470 on January 30, 1998, which was ratified through a plebiscite held on March 7, 1998, marks the birth of Compostela Valley. Access to province by air. It can be reached air via the Dabao International Airport, the capital town of Nabunturan. It's only a two-hour drive from Dabao City. You can also travel by uh, by sea. The province can be reached by sea through Sasa Wharf in the Bau City, a smooth through a smooth two-hour drive away. You can also travel by land. The capital town of Nabunturan can be reached by land from any point in Mindanao. Buses from Luzon and Visayas going to Davao will pass by the province by, before reaching their final destination. Tourist Destination Cultural Maragasan Mansaka Tribal Community The tribal community is composed of the Mansakas whose culture is unadulterated by the outside world. Among the attractions of the place are the tribes, authentic dances, native tribal jewelry, complete with antique necklaces, mansaka, musical instruments such as kudlong, paradag, and takol, a native saxophone, as well as their antique bells and gongs. These are some pictures of the Mansaka. As you can see, they have antique necklaces. Natural tourist destination, Tagbibinta Falls. 
Tagbibinta Falls, 5 km from the town proper, is Tagbibinta Falls. It has a series of 7 falls, the first one measuring approximately 700 feet in height. Next one is Kumaykai Falls. Kumaykai Falls, also known as the Panan Salan Falls, its unique feature can be seen in the 200 meter elevation forming what seems like the long hair of a woman. The third one is Malumagpak Falls. Malumagpak Falls boasts of four powerful water cascades that would perch on the ground at approximately 300 meters high. Malumag Pak Falls. It is home to freshwater streams known as Kawili. It is also the center of Mount Manurigao Adventure Climb. Observing a Mansaka tribal community is a notable part of the climbing event. Uh, this is the White Peak. Part of the proposed area for tourism development in Mount Tagu. It is so named because of the stones at the peak that glitter. It has a bonsai garden on the mountain top and the densely thick forest is home to wild animals like deer. Natural Tourist Destination San Vicente Cave in Nabunturan. San Vicente Cave. San Vicente Caves. It has four caves of varied attractions. One is a sinking cave, which starts with a 60 feet drop at its entrance. Play them with the beautiful formations. The second cave promises different treat with crystallized formation that look like a popcorn. Caves 3 and 4 are full of limestones. Next one is Kopiat Island. A 15 minutes boat ride from the Poblacion has a white sand beach. Kopiat Island, off the Davao coast. Kopiat Island boasts of clear and calm waters and wide sections of shoreline, blank bed with fine white sand. The, sec uh, the fifth one is the Kawakawa Island. Found in Sitio Mahayahay Barangay, Andidi Mawa. The 864-meter-long, entirely horizontal, Mahayahay Cave in Barangay, Toboran has a small 1.5 meters high underground waterfall tumbling into a small lake, curtain-shaped like stalactites and huge calcite pillars. The Mahayahay Cave A non-technical cave, it requires only a helmet and backup light to get there. Take tricycle or jeepney ride to Sitio Mahayahay, where it is a 2.5 hour hike through mixed forest to the mouth of the cave. You can come here, do not enter during heavy rains, the cave's water level rises dangerously fast. The Bagong Silang Cold Spring 
found in Barangay Bagong Sinang, Marubus, and Davao, has orchids, wild pigs, wild cats, uh, mago, tarsier, and wild deer. Uh, the next one is the Tagbibinta Falls. Found in Barangay Coron Nove, overlooking Maragusan Valley, is composed of 7 to 24 falls. The first one is approximately 7 feet, seven feet in height. Oops, Malita. This one is the Campili Cave. The Campili Lake. The 1 hectare Campini Lake is located atop Mount Campini. The local Mandaya tribe sometimes called this mountain as Forbidden Mountain. The next one is the Mount Candelaga. Mount Candelaga. The highest in the province and the third highest in Mindanao is home to rare flora and fauna, including the Raffolesia magnifica, the world's largest flower. The Mount de Walwal. Mount Diwalwal, the Montaya municipality is also host to the Gold Ridge Barangay of Mount Diwata, popularly known as Diwalwal, which is the local dialect means one's tongue is hanging out due to ex exhaustion. A 1,000 meter high range known worldwide for its gold ore deposit. The next one is the Tuburan Cave. The 344 meter long Tuburan Cave at Tuburan can be explored in 3 hours but requires technical skills and climbing equipment. Inside is a potable spring a 2 meter by 35 meter wide crystal clear underground river. Cave fish and crabs are abundant here and a 15 meter deep pit at the 250 meter mark the next one is the bukal hot spring it is a shallow boulder strewn river found in sarabon Nabunturan were hot and cold spring waters from the mountains coverage to form a lukewarm swimming area. Another mountain, Mount Angelo. At the Bukal Center, Behind the elementary school in Abunturan is a sulfuric mound said to be growing through the years. Man-made. Made by humans rather than occurring nature. Synthetic. First one. Golden Valley Resort Found in Magsaysay, Nabunturan, the resort offers two large pools for, for adults and children. It is a perfect for family outings. Other resorts Toyuzu Inland Resort Mainit Nabunturan Judiline Land Resort, Bamboo Anda, Kapatagan Island Resort, 
and Aguacan Cold Spring Resort in Maragusan. Okay, we go about the Dyson Farms. As you can see, it is a fom pomelo. Dyson Farms, Nueva Mawag. Dyson Farms is famous for growing a scientifically grown and chemically treated pomelo. Di Sabilano Farms. You can see its color is orange and on the center it's color green. Sevilano Farms, a special farm in Nueva Mawa, which grows a rare species of flora. Istan Filco Plantation. It is the doll company. Style Filco Plantation, new commonly known as Dole, Philippines, is originally a banana and pineapple plantation complete with packing plants. Now, we're going to go about the festivals in Davao. Anibina Festival from March 1 to 8 in Nabuntunan. It's coined from the words Ani, meaning harvest, and Bina, which refers to gold veins. The celebration con coincides the celebration of the founding anniversary of the province. The Indigenous People's Day. Indigenous Peoples Day, March 7, Nabunturan. The Indigenous Peoples Day. Indigenous Peoples Day, March 7, Nabunturan. An annual spectacle within the 8th day celebration of the founding anniversary of the province. On this day, the various tribal groups gather at the capital grounds to perform tribal dances and play tribal war games, as you can see in their costumes. The next one is the Pasagyao Huitan Festival. Yawitan Festival, 3rd week of November, Maragusan. It is a Thanksgiving festival for a bountiful harvest as well as the commemoration of the founding anniversary of the municipality of Maragusan, highlighting its ecotourism potential in its exotic tribes. Now, we will go about the products, delicacies, and cuisines. As you can see, there is a pineapple, pomelo, and banana. Davao del Norte, the religious. Regina Rosary and Mary's Wood Shrine. Man-made Municipal Agricultural Production Center, Pearl Farm, Beach Resort, The Island Buena Vista, Pag-asa Farms, The Lisay Village, Standard Fruit Philippine Props, or Stan Filco, Stan Filco, Double Pe Penal Colony. Festivals, 
Kapian Festival, Paragbu Festival, Pista ng Kana Kina Kinaiyahan Festival, Araw ng Dabog del Sur, del Norte, Oriental, Durian Festival, Banana Festival, Pangapog Festival, Sinabadan Festival, Andaon Festival. Kapya Kapyaan February 18 to 20 celebrates the founding anniversary of the creation of the municipality. Activities include uh, agro, uh, agro trade, fair exhibit, and cultural presentations. I'm going to report double dinosaur. Double dinosaur is the capital of town of Digo City, languages Cebuano, Visayan, and English. Double del Sur was created by the Con Con Congress on May 8, 1967, under Republic Act No. 4867. It started functioning as a province on July 1, 1967, comprising compre compre 10 municipalities, which Digos as its capital. The elected province provincial po positions were filled by appointment by the President of the Philippines until officials were, ju were duly elected and qualified in the, in the 1967 election. Historical Itakura Hills or Padada is home to about 30 interconnected World War II Japanese Fox Fox Holes, Japanese, Fox Holes, Tunnels are also located at the Poblacion and in the Bulutahay and Tologon in Pagunoy. Cultural Bilaan Cultural Tribe Village lies in the middle of the Tal Tampal in a small city named Lang Langlipu. Langlipo, Langlipo it is the it is this village that ethnic tribe Villa and Center. Tagakaulo Taga Cultural Tribal Village inhabit the western shores of the Gulf of Davao and southern part of the Mount Abo. Tagakaulo Taga from the mountains indicates that they came from the river sources. Tagakaulos believe in a Super, supernatural being who lives in Mount Apo. They offer him human sacrifices when they imagine that he is injured or when they come to the volcano to gather sulfur. Natural. Mount Apo is a large sulfatary sulfa potential, potentially active strat stratovolca stratovolcano in the in the island of Mindanao, Philippines, with with an altitude of 2,954 meters or 9,690 9, feet above sea level, it is the highest mountain in the country. It is located between Davao del Davao City and Davao del Sur Province in regions 11 and Cotabato Province in region 12. Tudaya Falls, located in Santa Cruz, was one of the highest falls in the country. Tiber Tubing, recommended activity in Sibulan River at Daro, Santa Cruz. The river is also named as one of the cleanest river in the country. Other natural resources, Mount Pispis, South Lamidan, Don Marcelino, Mount Sumadel, Don, Ma Don Marcelino, Mainit Spring, Kaburan Digo City, Lumayon Spring, Balalag Digos, Tindayo Falls, Sibulan, Santa Cruz. Kipanan Falls, Malita, Indalumong Falls, Pangalion, Malita, Kepia Falls, Lawa, Don Marcelino, Banag Falls, Dalupan, Don Marcelino, Marurong, Ulaniban Island, Pia, 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 or Padada.
man-made Mindanao Baptist Rural Life Center. Bansalan, it is the famous of its sloping agricultural technology or salt. Camp Sabros, ba, tatagpan siya sa Baras Digo City, the, the camp that is 3,980 feet above sea level, sits in an imme immense natural forest and wildlife. Festivals, Araw ng Dabog del Sur, July 1, celebration of the founding anniversary of the province. Activities include agro-industrial exhibits, trade fair, sports activities, cultural presentation, and shows. Products, San Miguel Corporation. Located in Darong Santa Cruz in San Miguel Brewery, reported to the most modern brewery in the country. Products located in Hagonoy is Double, Double Sugar Central Depot. The integrated meal which can crush 400 tons of sugar cane and refine 250 tons of sugar can can it a day. Double Oriental, Capital, Mighty, Languages, Cebuano, Mandaya, and English. Double Oriental, Sa Capital is Mati and borders Compostela Valley to the west and Agu Agusa del Sur and Surigao del Sur to the north. Double Oriental is the easternmost province of the country with Busan Point as the easternmost location. The Philippine Sea, part of the Pacific Ocean, faces Davao Oriental to the east. Part of the province, province lies on, on an unnamed peninsula that enclosed the Davao Gulf to the west. Cities and municipalities. Davao Oriental is divided into 10 municipalities and one city. City Ma Mati City Municipalities Bananga, Banay Banay, Boston, Caraga, Patil, Go Gobernador Heron Generoso, Lupon, Manay, Sa Manay, San Isidro, Aragon. People and Culture The native language spoken in this province are Camayo, also known as Mandaya. Cebuano is also spoken here. And Chab Chabacano de Davao being spoken by the people from Compostela Valley and Davao City. So now we go to show you the tourist destination. Cave of San Agustin. This is where St. Francis Javier supposed to have said his first mass. A lighthouse also stands at, at the site. <coughs> Tourist destination located in Pusan Point Revisited, located in the east, easternmost part of the Philippines where the first sunrise can be seen. Described as the site of the first sunlight of the new millennium. And now, here is a man-made. Menzi Tourism Complex is a 5-hectare area where the heritage villa of the late General Hans Menzi is located, a 10-minute flight from downtown Mass. Merco Plantation, a citrus plantation within 1,000 hectare Menzi Plantation, they, they produce fresh and processed citrus products. Lupa floating fish cage. Selecting, selected fish culture, you can enjoy fishing here and is within Kohuta Island. 40, 45 minutes by boat from Mati Park. Rock fish farm. A bangos culture farm. They process uh, and can and can bangus and other bangus products. 
multicolored tongues. It is very unique tongue, rich with love stories on why the tongue works. And now I will show you the festivals. Last week of October, Mati activities include cultural tribal shows and presentation, agri-industrial agri, agri trade fair exhibit. Journey to Mount Himigitan, a three-day trek to Mount Himagitan in Barangay La Union, San Isidro, where one can find the bonsai forest and Tinagong Daga. Banayan Festival is a celebration for the bountiful harvest among the people of the municipality. Products, delicacies, and seeds. The province is also mostly known mostly for its fish products such as bangus and other bangus products which is mostly supplied by the Blaflo Fish Farm. Fresh and processed citrus products are supplied from the Mepco plantation located in Mati City. Now, I will discuss to you the province of Davao City. Basic, basic facts Crown Jewel of Mindanao Fruit Basket of the Philippines Durian Capital of the Philippines Echo Adventure of Capital of the Philippines City of Loyalties Motto Love, Peace, and Progress Region Davao City is the Region 11 Barangays 182 182 City type, high urbanized city, incorporated town, 1848, incorporated city, March 16, 1936, founded by Don Jose Cruz de Uyangure of Spain. The mayor of Rodrigo R. Duterte and vice mayor, Paulo Z. Duterte, mayor of Davao. Tourist destination, Battle Memorial, a historical marker of the longest battle between the troops of the American Filipino forces and the Japanese Imperial Army. Japanese Peace Memorial Shrine, a memorial shrine de dedicated to the brotherhood of all men, regardless of race, creed, and ideology. Cultural, Davao Museum, it's the museum that offers the opportunity to understand the soul of the of people of Dabo. People Weaving Center, tribal women brought down from Cotabato and their demonstration of the traditional arts, crafts and skins of the of the colorful Bola tribe. Sulia Pupi Cultural Center and Industry institutional embodiment of historical, cultural, and social diversity and richness of Mindanao's life. Ford Academy of Arts, a learning center of arts and culture, culture show, showcasing works of local artists. Japanese Museum, future historical accounts of the Japanese community residing in Davao before during the war, including their tools, which they use in the abaca plantation, currencies, and communication. Manmade, Philippine Eagle Center, home of the Philippines National Bird, the largest eagle in the world, it is where they bred in captivity in order to increase their population and prevent extinction. Apple Gold and Country Country Club is about 11 kilometers south of the city. Proper facilities include clubhouse, 
conference hall, swimming pool, penalty court, restaurant that serves native delicacies, delicacies, golf set for rent upon request. Crocodile Farm, the only crocodile farm park in the region, provide home to lo to locally to locally crocodiles, including the country's best crocodile, namely pangi, pangi or bumps. Measuring over 18 feet in length, one can take pleasure from viewing horseback riding around the park or feeding the young fierce reptiles. Furukawa Plantation The Abaka Plantation in Daliao, which was acquired from the Bogobos as the result of the Otto Public Land Act in 1903. Gap Farm The Gap Farm has deluxe cottages, Olympic size swimming pool, picnic area, horseback riding facilities, convention, convention hall, and a World War II cave among others. It's located in Barangay Ma'a. Man-made Man Eden Nature Park, a popular plantation mount, mountain resort located in Eden, Torre District. Some 14, for, some 14 minutes away from the city center, it's 95% man-made which pine trees dotting the landscape, it covers 40 hectares of developed, developed land. People's Park This beach features a mini forest and large sculptures representing indig indigenous groups in southern Mindanao. Religious San, Be San Pedro Cathedral One of the oldest churches in Mindanao. The original sculpture of the of the church was built in 1847 in honor of Saint Peter. Don Hua Buddhist Temple. The biggest Buddhist temple in Mindanao is set in environment of kanda, trees and bamboo with an imposing statue of the Buddha. Mindanao Tau Tarusis Temple house the holy icons of the Taoist religion. Festivals, Feast of Santo Nino, January 15, Santo Nino Matina, Our Lady of Lourdes, Feast of St. Joseph, San Vicente Ferrer, San Isidro Lagrado. Santa Cruza, Sacred Heart, San Antonio Badua, Feast of St. Peter, San Roque, San Miguel, Christ, of the, Christ the King. Fil Philippine Eagle Week, Mindanao Trade Expo, Mindanao Tra Travel and Tour Expo, Kadayawan sa Davao. Kadayawan is, the, is, an, is an annual fest festival in the city of Davao. In the Philippines, its name derives from the friendly greetings Madayo from the double venue word Dayo, meaning good, val valuable, superior, superior, or beautiful. Thank you for listening and watching with us. And that's the end of our report. And once again, I'm Rochelle Panganiban and I'm Angeline Cuazo. That's all. Thank you and, and mabuhay. mabuhay.